What's going on, everybody? Welcome to Ripping Packs. It is a special edition Fantasy Rip League Thursday episode, and yes, I have a cold. Actually, I'm doing better now, but mm, yeah. So you're going to have to bear with my deep baritone voice if you can handle it. Anyway, what are we ripping today? Well, there's not been a lot of new football out, and I kind of went through the well of all the product I have. And to keep it fair with what everybody else is ripping or is going to rip, I'm going to 2021. Well, like I have a lot of it. We're going to rip open a hanger pack, a hanger, a hanger box, and a fat pack of Donruss. And we're going to rip open a hanger box and a fat pack of Prestige. That's right. It's time to fill our fantasy lineups for week 10, and we are going to hopefully put together a decent roster yet again. I'll see you in a second. Hi there. I'm Craig Michelson, and I just got back into the hobby after more than 15 years away. Join me as I reconnect with the hobby one pack at a time. Now let's rip some packs. Ripping packs on a Fantasy Rip League Special Edition rip in Week 10, and we are ripping open some 2021 football. We have Prestige, and we have Donruss, Fat Packs, and a hanger box of each. And we're going to assemble our team with this. But before we get to this, thank you. And thank you, and thank you. Yeah, I know it went quick there. And leave a comment if you want. I don't care right now. Really, I'm doing this so I can put the lead, put the, put the roster out there. If you want to leave a comment, say, what are you taking, Craig? What are you taking? Well, I'm taking Mucinex Throat Spray. I'm taking Mucinex, the Costco version. I am taking Dayquil. And yeah, and that's, and then steaming myself and drinking hot tea, and I hate tea. So yeah, that's what I'm doing. Anyway. You ready to rip this open? Great. But let's talk about Fantasy Rip League real quick. Fantasy Rip League is this. Me and a bunch of other YouTube uh, clowns are doing this. It's a, uh, I want to say there are about 10 to 12 of us right now. Card Dojo, ET Cards, Pacific Packs took the week off. Um, there's a handful of us, Vikings95 I believe is another one. And we're all doing this and we're all going to see who can go and play in next week. We've done it in waves, where the first two weeks we accumulate as many points as possible. And then we see who advances to the semi and the championship. So here we go. This is what we have to do. We have to fill all three, all eight of these spots. And we're getting points based on, if it's a base card, parallel, numbered, relic, all that fun stuff. And me opening the middle low end product I am, I'm probably hoping if I can get a three, I'd be happy. Yeah. But hey, beggars can't be choosy. And you know what? It's time to rip some packs. All right, are you ready to rip open? Let's go in uh, order. Let's go in uh, prestige first. We'll start with the prestige fat pack. I don't have, know how much this was. It was probably 10 bucks when it came out. It may have been seven bucks. I don't remember. But either way, we're gonna rip it open now. Are you ready? Rip packs, three, two, one. Let's rip open this fat pack. Let's go. All right, so you know the drill. It's gonna be rookies and parallels. Everything else is gonna go to this side. Kenner Porter, worthless. Noah Fant, Matt Stafford, DeAndre Swift, Emmanuel Sanders, T. Higgins for the Bengals, Corey Davis for the Jets, Nick Chubb for the Browns, Rashawn Evans for the Titans, Malcolm Jenkins for the Saints, Joey Bosa for the Chargers. We did get our parallels. Let's go to, let's get past our rookies and parallels first here. Uh, I assume, yeah, that's our last rookie. Danny Dimes. Hey, he's doing better this year. Tredavious White for the Bills, Melvin Gordon there, um, still at the Broncos, Aaron Donald for the Rams, Darius Slayton for the Giants, <laughs> Jimmy G, PC hit, but we'll take that out later, Aaron Jones for the Packers, Denzel Mims doesn't play not at all, Austin Hooper for the Browns, is he still there, Ryan Tannehill, uh, and there's Joey Bosa. Our first parallel is going to be LaVisca Chenault with the extra points for the uh, Jacksonville Jaguars, and he is now with the Carolina Panthers, but he is definitely not a play. That is the uh, what sunburst parallel, I believe. And DeAndre Swift, my God, if he's playing this week, this is my start, because the guy is, he has not been playing a lot, but there's DeAndre Swift with the astral parallel for the Lions. And then we got a Devontae Adams chills out on Sunday Night Football, one of their inserts they do. Uh, the time stamped or whatever it was. Uh, yeah, uh, highlight reel. There's time stamped. Henry Ruggs, wow. Mm, yeah, that's all I'm going to say. Wow. Henry Ruggs. 
And we got a prestigious pros here of Russell Wilson. I don't know how prestigious he is this year, but hey, you know what? You do you, Russell. You do you. And then Reggie Bush with the Living Legends. Reggie Bush with then the uh, Saints. And yeah, that's not getting a good play at all. Our rookies are Kylan, uh, Kylan Granson, tied in for the Colts. I don't know if he finished there, but whatever. Jamin Davis for the Washington Commanders, linebacker, and he's had a decent year too because I was looking him up because I pulled some really good cards of his, and yeah, I was hoping he'd do better. Sage Surratt, I don't even know if he's on the practice squad there for the Lions, the wide receiver, and Tyson Campbell, cornerback for the Jaguars, rookie card. Yeah, that kind of that kind of sucked. Got one playable card probably there. But hanger box time. Uh, probably picked this up for like 12 bucks at the time. I don't remember how much, but there's 60 cards side here. We're looking for the uh, hanger box astral parallels. Now you can get case hits in these. You can. Let's find out if we do. We're back three, two, one. Let's go. Ah, here we go. Okay. Yeah, the more I talk, the worse it gets. But hey, for you guys, I'll do it. And here we go. There is our playable stack of cards. Okay, we got a, another kid reporter here, so we'll pull all the other stuff from the back. Pull, leave the rookies there at the end. We got Patrick Queen for the Ravens, T.Y. Hilton for the Colts. I don't know if he's playing anymore. Corlin Sutton for the Broncos. Cooper Cup might be a play, a single. Uh, single point, TJ Hawkinson now with the Vikings, Leighton Vander Esch for the Cowboys, Hayden Hurst for the Falcons, Patty Mahomes for the Chiefs, Chandler Jones for the Cardinals, Mari Cooper for the Cowboys, now the Browns, Tua going off this year when he's healthy, Jakey Dobbins took a step back, Corey Davis for the Jets, Nick Chubb for the Browns, Rosson Evans for the Titans, Malcolm Jenkins for the Saints, Joey Bosa again, Logan Thomas for the Commanders, Traquan Smith for the Saints. He might, well, no, the Saints are horrible. A.J. Brown, now with the Eagles. Mike Williams with the Chargers. Raheem Mostert, now with the Dolphins. Ross John Gray with the Packers. Jamison Crowder, the Jets. Allen Robinson, now with the Rams, but not new and too hot. Danny Dimes again. Tredavious White again. Melvin Gordon again. Aaron. <laughs> See, I wasn't lying, people. I wasn't lying. I'm doing it for you. Aaron Donald again. Darius Slayton again. Cole Beasley. Well, he's definitely not a play. Joe Mixon. Oh, my God. He went off for me last week. Joe Mixon was, I mean, that was one of the best fantasy weeks you could ever hope for. And honestly, just got balled out. Deshaun Watson, definitely not. Forrest Buckner for the Colts. Michael Thomas for the Saints. Keenan Allen for the Chargers. Jimmy G yet again. Aaron Jones again. Denzel Mims again. Austin Hooper again. Oh, my God. I'm just getting the same cards. Uh, Kirk Cousins. He's had a decent year. Chase Vinovich, James Conner, our first parallel. It's a rookie extra points. It is Davis Mills. Um, this is a short print, too. The Astral Davis Mills short print. I know that because when I pulled last year, I'm like, oh, I didn't even know who the guy was. But that is a short print right there. There is Davis Mills. Well, I didn't even do a rookie pile, for God's sakes. That's how bad pack one was. But there is Davis Mills. He's going to go to the rookie pile. Then we did get an... Uh, a astral here of Robert Woods now with the Titans and definitely not a play because the guy just is yeah they just don't run the ball through him there's no there's yeah he doesn't get anything Jared Goff that might be a play that might be a play Jared Goff with the astral for the Lions Adam Thielen man I'm gonna take in Justin Jefferson right there but Adam Thielen with the uh, Vikings with the astral parallel Damian Harris might be a play too, but I mean, he's on my real fantasy team and he's he's not been playing. And I know he had that injury and then Ramondre Stevens has been really taking his uh, reps away from him. And uh, Chris Evans is our rookie. <laughs> yeah, Chris Evans with the rookie Astral right there. So, mm. and then we got another prestigious pros here, Julian Edelman. That is definitely not going to be a play either because, well, the dude doesn't play anymore. Did we get a... Oh, we got a... Maybe, I don't know. De Devin White here for Powerhouse. Yeah. No. Howie along with the Living Legends. Well, I can't play Howie. I can tell you that much. I could play him if we were doing the Broadcaster Pool. And then we got a... 
Louisiana, Jamar Chase, season's greetings. Um, that might be a play if he's back, but I don't think he's back yet. But that's pretty awesome there. Getting from LSU. Jamar Chase, reigning uh, rookie of the year. Put you over here in the rookies. Trey Lance, okay. Gordon can't play him, but at least the PC hit there for the Niners. Cornell Powell, did he ever play a snap last year? I knew he was in the taxi squad, and I think they cut his ass, but there's Cornell Powell for the, uh, the Chiefs. There's Jamar Chase base for the Bengals. Shy Smith, who went undrafted and actually has done decent for the Panthers there. Rookie card for the Carolina Panthers. And Michael Carter, the rookie uh, for the Jets, who has turned into bell cow for like a week, and then they went and got James Robinson, but... There is Michael Carter and Prestige. Eh. Donruss, save us. All right, it's time for the Donruss Fat Pack. Now, you guys saw these things around. They were everywhere you wanted to buy cards. So then they disappeared because, well, everything disappeared. But we're going to rip this open. We have 60, uh, 30 cards inside here. We're looking for the four press proof parallels. And those are what we're going to get double points on unless we get an auto or a hit. Let's hope we get something decent. Let's go. All right, Julian Edelman, nope. Levon, uh, Levante David, Kirk Cousins, Bobby Wagner, Josh Jacobs, Fred Warner, PC Hit, Vaughn Miller, Chad Ocho Cinco Johnson, Xavier Howard for the Dolphins, Brian Burns for the Panthers, Johnny Hecker no longer with the Rams, Michael Vick, Mike Williams is not playing right now. Oh, we got a bunch of backwards. Oh, that's the, uh, whatchamacallit cards. Okay, there's a bunch of stuff. Well, I'm just gonna go in order. Kyler Murray. And boom. All right, we got Patty Mahomes here with the, it's a variation. So would it be a parallel? Maybe I'll put him in the parallel anyway. Uh, Jameson Crowder here. Actually, I'll show it to you. I mean, you, it's not like you haven't seen this card before um, from last the last year, but there is the Patrick Mahomes. There's Jameson Crowder. John Elway with the variation. That variation right there, Not definitely not a play. Keenan Cole. Odell Beckham with a variation. Yeah, that's not being played either because yeah, he, he he's going to sign with the Cowboys. T.J. Watt, Devontae Adams with a variation. So maybe it depends if I get double points for it. Then Minka Fitzpatrick, rated rookie here, Peyton Turner for the Saints, going into the rookie pile. Uh, Marquez Stevenson, like I don't have enough of this clown. Uh, Marquez Stevenson, the wide receiver for the Bills. And Travis Etienne, okay. I mean, Travis Etienne's finally coming into his own, and I don't know if I actually pulled his rookie last year out of Donruss, so there is Travis Etienne right there. Go to our parallels here. Our blue is Leonard Fournette. That might be a start, maybe, with the press proof. Lenny Fournette, maybe. Um, then we have uh, Russell Gage. That's definitely not a start. Damn it. Russell Gage there with the Falcons. And then we have a backwards card here of Lamar. That's probably going to be our start. Lamar press proof with, um, yeah, depends who the Ravens. More than likely he's the start, unless they're on bye, which I don't know. But there is Lamar. That's definitely going to be our start. Two times points. Lamar. Then Kylan Hill for the Packers. Rookie. Nope, that's not going to be a start. And the last card is Travis Etienne with, no, Terrace Marshall. Wow with the rookies. So, yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah, Lamar, maybe one. All right, it's time for the hanger box. We got four rated rookies and four parallels. Pro I think these are the red ones. I could be wrong though, but that's what we're looking at. 50 cards inside of here and one pack per box, one whole pack, and it's a big cellophane pack. You ready to rip this open? Great, let's get this over with. Let's go. Okay, so, save me Donner Sangers. Save me, Donruss Hanger. Okay. Okay, yeah, we, got, we got the red press proofs here. All right, and we got all at the back here. We got Jarvis Landry, Jalen Rigger. Uh, no longer there. He's with the Vikings. Roquan Smith is no longer there. Lawrence Taylor's. Uh, Retire Cole Beasley is no longer there. Stephon Gilmore, Marquise Brown is no longer there. Harrison Smith, Mike Evans, Darren Waller, Mo Alley Cox, Logan Thomas, 
Zach Cunningham, Derrick Henry, maybe, TJ Hawkinson, Emmanuel uh, Uga Boga, <laughs> Trey Henderson for the Bengals, Tua, Sam Darnold, that's definitely not, even though he's healthy again. Kyler Murray for, I mean, Kenneth Murray for the Chargers. Larry Fitzgerald, C.D. Lamb, T.J. Watt, Emmett Smith, Joe Montana, P.C. Yeah. Devontae Adams for the Packers. Tyreek Hill, maybe. Uh, Adrian Amos for the Packers. Brett Favre with a piece of turd. Um, yeah, just Google it. Uh, Alejandro Villanueva, Josh Allen with, I'm still starting Lamar, definitely. Tom Brady, rated rookie here, is going to be Shy Smith. We just talked about you, Shy, but there's your Donner's rated rookie, Shy Smith. Davis Mills, it's a Shy Smith, Davis Mills days, ladies and gentlemen. There's Davis Mills with the rated rookie, who's kind of gone downhill, but still is a decent rookie last year. Patrick Sertain for the uh, Broncos with the uh, rated rookie. And our last rated rookie is Chuba Hubbard, who... Uh, he's getting some reps now. I mean, he's been out the last two weeks, but um, now with Christian McCaffrey gone, him and Demo uh, Don Don uh, Donta Foreman are the, the bell cows. Not bell cows, that's one guy. Our Reds are Dallas Kader. Okay, maybe for the Eagles, definitely, if they're playing this week. Again, I have to check. Um, I don't, actually, they are because I already started Jalen on a bye week. Jeff Akuda for the Lions. I did start the Lions last week. Uh, defense. Granted, they played the Packers, so I got lucky there. But there's Jeff Akuda. A uh, maybe. Terry Bradshaw. Really? Really? Terry Bradshaw. Sure as hell can't play this guy. Terry friggin' Bradshaw. Not, not that he's bad. It's just like I, I'm ripping these so I can play cards. Not a bad... Okay, I'm probably not going to play it, but that's not a bad pull. Trevor Lawrence Red. Okay. The goal wasn't to pull like awesome cards or whatever, but okay, I'll take this. I I pulled a Mac Jones red um, earlier or later earlier in the year last year, and ended up selling it and did pretty well. I'll put it that way, did pretty well. But Trevor Lawrence there, that's a uh, it's got a ding in it too. Ah shit. Gridiron Kings here of Aaron Donald for the Rams. We got a DeAndre Swift with the. Uh, Power formula. Yeah, I know. I, I, I might as well start singing some You Never Find. Yeah, there's DeAndre Swift, Power Formula. TJ Hawkinson with the uh, Elite Series. Now with the Vikings, like I said. Elite Series. Just an insert. Insert still only gets you one point. Oh, one time. Kyle Trash with the Elite Series. Rookies. Yeah, guy's never going to get his chance to play, and he's going to go back to bagging groceries at Winn-Dixie. The champ is in with the uh, Chris Godwin for the uh, for the Buccaneers. We got a uh, Sam Darnold with Jets quarterback runs show and ball over Denver with the uh, highlights. It, yeah, proved so much of a highlight they got rid of your ass, and you haven't had any highlights since then. Retro series here, Kurt Warner for then the Cardinals, but he's always a Ram in my eyes, a St. Louis Ram. Quinnen Nelson with the Action All Pros for the Colts. Quinnen Nelson. The rookies here of Amon Ross St. Brown uh, with the Lions, who had, um, he, he's solid too, but again, it's just an insert. And Tom Brady here with Dominators. Not a bad card to pull, but not playing it. But there's Tom Brady with Dominators. So, all right. I'm going to wipe this off. I'm going to try to assemble a team here. I'll see you guys in a second. All right, and we are back. And, uh, well, here's my attempt. <laughs> Week 10. So, at quarterback, we're going to go with Jared Goff because, well, a certain uh, Baltimore Orioles, uh, Baltimore Ravens quarterback is on by this week. Yeah. Happened to me last week, too, with Dak Prescott. So, really didn't have any other options side of Davis Mills. I'm just not sold on Davis Mills right now. So, at least Jared Goff's going to probably throw the ball. So, there's that. At tight end, we're going to go with Dallas Gadare for the Eagles. Wide receivers. Now, I might tweet, tweet, uh, tweet these out. These are photo variations, and I don't know if they're going to get one point or two point because parallels are considered two points. Tyreek Hill and Devontae Adams. Either way, both of them should have strong games. Um, for running backs, 
getting two points for DeAndre Swift if he plays. I might have to swap him out for somebody else. And I'm going Leonard Fournette. Yeah, they're playing in Munich, Germany, but something tells me there's going to be a lot of running in that game. So Leonard Fournette. For a defense or kicker, a player going Aaron Donald. Really, didn't, I did not pull a single kicker. I pulled a punter, for God's sakes, but I didn't pull a kicker. And for defense, I'm going to the Lions again. I know, I'm pathetic, but they're playing the Bears. And I think that, don't get me wrong, I think Justin Fields is going to have a good game. But when it came down to it, I didn't pull any defense that was worth, a uh, defensive player that was worth anything. So I might make a tweak, but I'm pretty much going to lock, be locked off on the defensive uh, on the defense for the Lions at times two. So there you go. Lock it in till Saturday night right there. All right, so I would go over the hits here real quick. Um, I mean, I'll just go over some of the rookies here. Uh, no, okay. Da 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 da. Trey Lance, uh, Jamar Chase season greetings out of prestige. That was pretty sweet. I will say, I do like those cards. Um, I do always thought they're pretty cool. Chris Evans, Astral. Um, even though the guy's like a kick returner, doesn't mean anything. Uh, Davis Mills. This was a good hit out of prestige, even though he's having a kind of a slightly downish year. But Davis Mills for prestige uh, with the Astral parallel. I'm on Ross St. Brown. Uh, for the Lions with the uh, the rookies, Kyle Trash, this Trevor was a big pull, except for all three of the four corners are dinged. I don't get how that happens. This isn't like in the middle of the pack, and the other cards around it were fine. I mean, I just don't. Uh, Hubbard, Sullivan, uh, uh, Sertain, Davis Mills again, Shea Shai Smith, Terrace Marshall with the rookies, Kylan Hill, Press Proof, ETN. Marquez Stevenson and Pat, uh, Peyton Turner, but man, this 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 Trevor man, it's I mean, it's got some damage everywhere on this thing. My God, I don't know if you guys can see from out there, but it's got a soft, it's got a indented corner on the both corners here. The, this one right here, it's got a little bit of a just a man. This would not get an eight, but then again, I'm waiting on. I just got my re, you know return from Panini on some other stuff. And then this is the only corner. One of the four damn corners is fine. Ah, God damn it. And that's, that's, ah. it's like they knew and they just kind of like, so yeah. Um, I mean, and I would go over other cards, but to be honest with you, I need to just stop talking. So thank you so much for watching Ripping Packs on this Fantasy Ripley Week 10. Um, I wouldn't be here for watching, so thank you so much. And if you weren't liking, so yeah, uh, yeah, thank you so much. Notification bell, and again, leave a comment. And the comment is, what the hell do you take when you get a cold? Yeah. Uh, come back on Friday. I already shot that episode. Uh, it's Prism Basketball. Uh, I sound normal. Um, so yeah, and it's, yeah, I'll just say, yeah, that's all I'm going to say. Anyway, take care. Thanks for ripping some packs. Uh, thanks for watching Rip Packs. And until then, always rip some packs.